We were sent home and told our time to fight is over. When we came home, the world that we knew had changed. Too many of our veterans could not cope with everyday normal lives. The fight wasn't over. It couldn't be turned off. Many had nowhere to turn to. No one to talk to, to understand what's going on. That's why we used our music as an outlet to tell our story, to help the civilian warrior. Your tags hanging on a review mirror. We put our music careers in Nashville, Tennessee on hold. Then we hit the road. We traveled across this beautiful country, finding veterans like ourselves, listening to their stories and their advice about returning home. Hey y'all, on this episode of Echoes of Valor, we're taking the RV down to Murfreesboro to Michael Burroughs H3O Aquatic Center to help veterans start living a healthy life. Would y'all come with us? Go get the RV now. Hey, you're the young whippersnapper. You go get it. He said as he left and showed me, you can't live without me. Do I go straight or turn right? Ask the uh, GPS how to get there. Man, you should have taken a left back there. I really can't <laughs> drive, you guys. Well, you're proving that by the second. <laughs> I live inside of you! You know why the army exists, don't you? The Marines gotta have heroes. I don't want to hear anything from you, ain't ready to be Marines yet. Uh, I think this is the GPS for Alabama. I don't even know where we're at right now. Navy, what was your MOS? Getting lost. We're actually here. So turn back. It's been known to matter. Alright guys, follow me and I'm gonna show you the hydro massage bed. Hey man, we would have been here sooner, but the Navy's scared of water, so. You don't have to take your clothes off, you don't have to get naked, you don't have to shower. Now the Mayo Clinic and the Walter Reed Army Hospital use this same device. It's just Walter Reed is doing this, because when I was in Bethesda, they just waterboarded this. Uh, I don't think it's the same thing. <laughs> All right, and this wall is our chalkboard wall where some of our patrons like to draw stuff and write encouraging quotes and things like that. I've got a couple quotes I'll leave on the wall for we leave. All right, guys, this is our heated therapy pool. It's the most advanced aquatic exercise and therapy center in the country. Uh, we work with the VA hospital. We have a charity set up to help veterans. <clears throat> this is my friend JT. He's been coming for a while. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, man? How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Hey, man, what have you been up to? I got involved with a group called Veterans Restoration Foundation. So we try to help veterans find their way. We try to help the new guys come back, find things that they may not know about like Operation Stand Down or H3O. Where's who? We help them find connection with jobs and job training. They also executive produced this TV show. Like Kat, she's been coming here for a while. Kat, tell us about your experiences here at H3O, because I mean, we've heard of you, JT. What have you had going on? Um, I actually suffer from PTSD myself, and I have some back injuries that I suffered while I served over in Iraq. I usually come in here three to four times a week, go across the way here to the treadmill, put on some five-finger death punch. Yeah! I play four-finger death punch because I'm missing a finger. <laughs> there you go. Where did he go? Man, I don't know. He's old. He's probably doing old people things, like an arthritis convention or something. I don't know, but he'll be here. He's just, he's just like I said, he's old. We gotta wait on him. In all your years, you went and faced our darkest fears. And now the world's a better place to come home to. One thing we have to realize is we've got to lock shields. It's one mission, one fight. We can't do this alone. Right. We've got to do it together. And so it's true. Us together, we can go out there and find these organizations we can pass on to our veteran brothers and sisters and show them that, you know what? We can do anything in the world that anybody can do. Without a thought. And now there's me. We picked old JT over there. We didn't know he was a picker like us, but uh, I just want to sit here and play some music. It was only right to bring him along, other <laughs> veterans, so we can get here and pick. And we found this old guy along the way, too. Dave Littrell's old Vietnam buddy here, Mr. Sam Tate. Y'all might know him. He might, have, he might have written something you've heard on the radio, or yeah. everything you've heard on the radio. Hey y'all, we've had a heck of a day, man, out here uh, learning about veterans and how we can help them. I know we had a great time over at H3O Aquatics. What'd you guys think about that? H3O Aquatics is very relaxing. Oh, I bet it was. I bet it was. <laughs> Took my
To learn more about Veterans Restoration Foundation, go to veteransrestoration.org.